What's going on, guys? How are you guys doing today? So, guys, woo, it feels amazing out here. Virginia, keep this weather coming. I'm loving it. All right, now, here's the main reason why you all clicked on this video. Right back here is my house. And what we're going to do is we're going to take a house tour. Literally like an MTV Cribs type of video, you know? You know what I mean. But hey, let's get after it. MTV Cribs, Belmar 616 official. Uh, now, there's the house key. Let's go inside and show you all around. A little MTV Cribs-esque type of video here. All right, now you come up the steps. Pick the shoes too, I really like these. You got two hanging plants right here. This place is like full of plants, especially on the outside. You've got a red chair and a table right there with another plant. And then a little home sign right there, which that um, flower that's on it. That right there will be changed from time to time. So now, the moment y'all been waiting for, let's go inside. By the way, we do have a little rain doorbell right there. So if somebody will like rat us out, that'd be the case. That basically how it would happen. So we're in here. And as you come in, you got a little, the Remy family sign right there. Some shoes. They're all over the place, especially in my room. <laughs> it's, I really, I really don't want to talk about that. But anyway, you've got a little essential oil diffuser. Help keep the house smelling clean. We got those all over the place. And as you'll see here in just a second. And coming on to the other side, you got a little storage space right here, which is virtually nothing in here except for I don't know. There's a lot of stuff in here. And then you got a little picture. It's me and uh, Abigail Kenser from 2020. Y'all remember Kenser? She started in the prom vlog. Y'all may remember that. But anyway, coming on to this side, you've got my mom's arts and crafts space. She's a big time cricket person. <laughs> I'm sure we may all know a person who was into that stuff, which basically this whole entire space this is all dedicated to her really no kidding right here you got a little chair we've had for years and years and years and on this table we've got a coaster a printer amazon echo and a lamp that is actually a smart control and this sectional right here i don't know if i feature that we have another sectional out in the patio as you'll see here in just a second here in a few minutes, really. All right, now, essential oil space. These are all over the place. A little essential oil space right there. Behind every great boss is a great team. That was my mother's birthday present from not too long ago. And right here, got a little robot vacuum or whatever the heck those are called. I don't know what they're called, but this is a, a shark. Right here, you've got a little table right here with the uh, old, Bose, old Bose speaker. Really can't function well in today's society as it really only, as it really can only play CDs. Right here, you've got a little dining room, four person, turn on the lights. Again, here's the dining room. Got a bunch of coats coat hanger, coats and jackets, book bags, whatever the case may be. That's all there, I'll let my keys right here. Right here, we got a little chair and a bucket hat. That's my dad's bucket hat, by the way. And then right here, you've got the kitchen. Whoa! Almost dropped this thing right here. There's another diffuser. That's something to go in your car. Right here, a little GE profile ice maker. Pellet ice, kind of like what you get at Sonic, if you know what I'm talking about. Got a little bowl right there, consisting of some bananas. Another Amazon Echo. And then another diffuser. These things are all over the house. 
and coming around. There's some paper towels, by the way, and here's the sink. And right here, you've got a massive refrigerator and freezer. This, this thing is stinking massive. And we've got stuff in there per usual. Typically, what you would expect. And back to the other side, you've got three drawers, three cabinets, well, five cabinets. The reason why I say, the reason I say, uh, why do I keep stuttering? The reason why I say these, the reason why I say that is these cabinets are actually locked. There's no way you can get in there. But right here, you got the dishwasher, GE brand, little trash can, which I'm pretty sure you all don't want to see in there. Another set of drawers and cabinets featuring all of our uh, silverware. And right here, this is like a little air fryer toaster oven. These things are pretty unique. This is a Ninja, Ninja brand. Right here, you got a little wall oven, GE brand. Right here, you got the pantry with a lot of food, some drinks on the floor and another trash can. Right here, you got a little toaster. Not gonna fire it up right now. Right here, you got some silverware right there, cutlery. Some glassware right here. Some uh, plates, bowls, coffee mugs, and all that. Paper plates right here in this cabinet, baking soda. All that good stuff, all that jazz. A little coffee maker right there with some coffee accessories. So if you wanna brew you a cup while you're here, you're more than welcome to do so. Right here, got you all your seasonings, salts and all that. You know, seasoning salt, all that. In this cabinet is coffee mugs. Right here is where all the coffee goes and all that. Let's see, we got Duncan. All that jazz. Little stove top up here. You got the microwave, which I don't know why it just fired up there. It's been doing that for a while. Right here, got a bar. This is a, uh, this is space for three. You can expand however you like it. And coming around on the other side, you've got the living room. Right here, a little sound bar, cable box, DVD player, Nintendo Switch, with this Samsung TV, it's 65 inch, 4K HDR. A little table right there, a little picture says memories consisting of me and my sister. I think this is from like 2019. Got a view overlooking the back porch. Which we'll get to that here in just a second. And you've got a lamp. Again, it's smart controlled. Got a little table, this pull out compartment. A lot of stuff is in there, so I'm not gonna fool with that. Got a drawer right here. A lot of stuff in there as well. Right here, you got a little sectional. And this space right here actually opens up. So if you want to store a little something in there, you are more than welcome to. Little storage space right there. And right here, little bench couch. These are actual recliners. All this, just kick back, watch Netflix, whatever you want to do. Maybe challenge me into a game of Mario Kart or something like that. Whatever the case may be, you're more than welcome to do so. Right here. Another storage compartment slash little table, kind of like what's on the other side. But this right here, got a, a set of coasters. I don't know why I'm stuttering a whole lot. Right here, little storage space, little drawer, all kinds of stuff in there. Blankets, thermostat up here. A little picture right here, this is from Local photographer, Tim Cox, overlooking the Big Stone Gap overlook up on the valley, a nice place. And then right here is a literal doom stuck in what I like to call the brown room. Oh, it's so haunting. There's nothing in here. That's the reason why it's a literal doom stuck. But the only thing is you've got a little computer right here. And I wanna know from you all, 
What should go in here? Should it be a guest bedroom? A home gym? What should it be? Just let me know in the comments. There's absolutely nothing in here. And then right here is the fun zone, AKA my room. Right here, you got a little headset, a fan, a lamp, and another diffuser. That diffuser is freaking massive. I mean, just look at that. Right here, five tier drawer. Got lots of all kinds of stuff in there. A little lap desk. And um, you got a little couch in here. So if somebody were to challenge me into a game of whatever it may be, like 2K, Madden, whatever it may be, you just sit right there and challenge me into a game. Right here, you got my bed. A little Tennessee themed. And then right here is the media set. Let's see, you've got an Xbox. As an Xbox Series S. Some stuffed animals back there. The head binding that little compartment is Ducky. I've had him for years and years and years. Right here, in here is a little cable box and some uh, cards. I mean, <laughs> this thing goes on and on and on. Right here, you've got your view overlooking the carport. Of course, no one's home except for me. There's the headset fan, lamp, and all that I just mentioned. Here you got my closet, which is another dumpster fire. Really needs a cleaning, if anything. Here you got some mats. UT, 2021-22, NBA champion, Golden State Warriors. Those of y'all know that I'm a big time Warriors fan. And right here you got my sunglasses with a little lanyard and a little necklace. I wore this one in the fair vlog on day two. But there's the brown room, I just, as I just mentioned. Right here, got my bathroom. Here you got a little sink. Wash your hands. That's what it says right there. Right here, you got all my uh, accessories and all that, like toothpaste, deodorant, hair gel, and all that. Now there you got my razor, because I do grow a lot of facial hair from time to time. Mm -hmm. Got a little drawer consisting of my aviators. Got those for prom. A little kickstand for my iPad. In that drawer, this is a four-tier drawer right here in this cabinet. A lot of different stuff in there. A little trash can right there. Here's the toilet for you toilet people. I'm gonna flush the toilet for you. That's your five seconds of fame. And now, here's the bathtub. Your bath shower combination. You close this up. Some uh, pretty neat stuff. Some uh, towels right there, laundry and all that. A little bureau right there, whatever the case may be. <clears throat> and as you come out, let's go check out the other side of the house. You've got your lot. You got the laundry room right here. Lots of laundry in here. Washer, the dryer, and some laundry baskets right there. An iron, all that jazz. I mean, this. I mean, this place has it all. It's very small, but it can have pretty much everything you may need. I wish. Maya Angelou-esque painting. Right here, you got the master bedroom. This is my mom and dad's room. It's a dumpster fire on occasion, but I cleaned this place before I filmed this video. Right here, you got my mom's nightstand featuring an Amazon Echo, a diffuser, a white noise machine, and an alarm clock. And this wireless phone charger. No set of AirPods. This is a Three-tier drawer, three-tier nightstand, and right here, well, let's feature the other parts of the room before we get to that closet. You got my mom's vanity, which is another little dumpster fire. Peep the kicks too, on clouds. <clears throat> Laundry basket right there, which is um, primarily towels and all that. Just ran a load of hot towels. So that's why that basket is empty. Right there, you got the view. Not much to see, except maybe if you want to look out on the road, you can. 
This is oftentimes close though. So, so yeah. Again, same thing. And this right here overlooks the road. You can see you got those plants in the way. <laughs> These things are all over the place. Right here, you've got the bed. And then on this side, you've got my dad's nightstand featuring a long clock, little night lights. And there's his house clothes. And then right here, let's go check out the closet. A little dumpster fire. I'm not going to turn the lights on. It's, this place is a mess. Let's admit it. And right here, master bathroom. You got dual sinks right there. A toilet. You know what? I'm gonna flush the toilet for you toilet fans. Another five seconds of fame for you all. Toilet paper and all that. Right here, walk-in shower. I'm not gonna fire it up right now. Here's the walk-in shower. And then right here is the math it's the master bath. Nothing exciting in there. As this doesn't have like jets or anything on it. There's that. This is already longer. This video in general is already longer than the Unit 7212 tour that I made about two summers ago, summer 2021. But right here is the last part of this tour is the back porch and our patio. I'm gonna lock it. There we go. Right here, got a little space right there to kick back and have a good time. Maybe sunbathe if you want to. Here's a little space right there consisting of like basketballs. There's the same ball that I won at the fair. Hoping to film a three point contest with Brody here in the coming weeks. Three chairs right there, and then another two on this side. And then right here is the grill. So maybe fire out some hamburgers, hot dogs. Fourth of July is coming up as soon as I'm filming this video though. And you've got lights on these bars, which are actually solar powered. As you can see, it is currently 321. Not much to see on that end. And as you come down the steps, here are the, here's the patio. We built this one in the summer of 2020 when everything was locked down and all that. Right here, you've got the sectional, which I just mentioned. A little fire pit right there. And you got a chair on the corners. You got one over here too. And here, here's, a, here's a massive plant. A row of plants right there. And you can look over there. Let me zoom in. It's very hazy. You see over there is John Burton High School. Home of the Raiders. <laughs> And then right there's the carport, as we just mentioned. And so yeah, that is a little house tour for you all. Let's go to the outro. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you guys wanna see more content like this, all you gotta do is like this video and subscribe if you are new. And if you wanna see more behind the scenes content, news and updates, you can follow me on your favorite social media platforms whether it be Instagram, Snapchat, whatever the case may be, at Filmer616TV. Now, onto the video for just a second. Final summary, final thoughts. This kind of, you know, it kind of addresses my desire to film some new room tours. And I wanted to kind of spice it up a little bit by filming a house tour. But however, I've got y'all. I've got some brand new room tours on the line here soon. I'll keep y'all posted on social media regarding all that. But hey, nonetheless, I'll see y'all next video. And until then, peace out.